childhood obesity has reached epidemic proportions around the world. Research has shown that the most effective interventions for obesity prevention are theory-driven and behavior-focused. This study systematically reviewed and synthesized dietary behavior interventions based on the theory of reasoned action and theory of planned behavior that targeted adolescents and young adults. It used the theory of reasoned action to predict behavioral intention using one's attitude and their subjective norms towards the behavior. Attitude describes the positive or negative feelings an individual holds towards a certain behavior, while subjective norms refers to the perceived social pressure to perform a behavior. The theory of planned behavior also considers the construct of perceived behavioral control, which refers to the amount of control a person believes they have over performing a behavior. The theory of planned behavior hypothesizes that an individual who has a favorable attitude toward physical activity believes that physical activity is positively viewed by others whose opinions matter to them and considers themselves to have control over their physical activity behaviors, will be likely to be physically active. Of the 11 intervention studies evaluated in the systemic review, nine resulted in dietary behavior change that was attributed to the treatment. All but one of the studies found a change in at least one construct of the theory of reasoned action, or theory of planned behavior. Among all the studies, four utilized technology, including emails, social media posts, information on school websites, web-based activities, audio messages in classrooms, interactive DVDs, and health-related websites. Interventions directed towards changing dietary behavior in adolescents should aim to incorporate multifaceted approaches that consider the theories of reasoned action and planned behavior.